This is the main event of WrestleMania 30 for the richest prize in the business. Randy Orton defends his WWE World Heavyweight Championship in a triple threat match against the Royal Rumble winner Batista and the leader of the Yes Movement, Daniel Bryan. Everyone enters with determination to succeed in the main event of this historic 30th WrestleMania. But Daniel Bryan enters with the Yes Movement on his back and a shoulder attack by Triple H in the first match of the show. Well, this is Triple H's last line of defense. Daniel Bryan somehow still standing after his first match and Triple H's attack. Now Daniel Bryan is going to wage battle against Triple H's two biggest soldiers. If Orton and Batista can work together, Bryan won't be a factor. Big time slam. Vicious. What a stomp. Good grief. Beautiful technique. defeated Triple H earlier tonight, but he's still a WrestleMania rookie compared to his opponents here tonight. It's not even close, Cole. Paul Bryan's done at WrestleMania before tonight was lose a match in 18 seconds two years ago, then rely on Kane to get the job done last year. Orton and Batista have so much more big match experience. There it is. Hurricane Rana. Michael, Corey, the two of you mentioned Brian's lacking resume compared to Batista and Orton. And it's true. Batista beat Triple H in the main event of WrestleMania 21 and had championship matches at WrestleMania 23 and 26. And the Apex Predator is in his 11th consecutive WrestleMania. He was in the main event at the 25th anniversary of WrestleMania and successfully defended the WWE Championship against John Cena and Triple H the year before that. Brian is extremely outclassed tonight. Outrageous athleticism on the Hurricanrana. Boom, what a pack! Well, breakneck speed, what a Hurricanrana. Set him up a Russian leg sweep. A high-risk maneuver that works from that top turnbuckle. He might have it. Look at this. Orton enters WrestleMania as WWE World Heavyweight Champion, but I have to wonder if he's still got the killer instinct of the Apex Predator. He's been hiding behind the authority an awful lot lately. Oh, please, Byron. We're seeing the rebirth of Randy Orton. Last year, he won the WWE Championship at SummerSlam, successfully defended his title against guys like... The Enemy hits this. This one's over. I don't like the look in his eye. Oh, damage to the body. This could be it, guys. Drop kick. Beautiful. Vertical suplex. Nice. Oh, he's got him here. He's got him up. Oh! Nailed it. Oh, what incredible power. Wow, what a vertical suplex. Elbow finds its mark. He knows he's in trouble. The Yes Lock is in! The Yes Lock is in! Unreal! The Yes Lock's applied! Orton might tap out the... Oh, look who's back! Triple H! Stephanie! The authority just wants to have a bird's eye view of what's going on. Yeah, yeah, no, more than that, Corey. Triple H just ripped the referee out of the ring! I believe Daniel Bryan could have won the championship right there! But clearly Triple H is still bitter over losing to Daniel Bryan earlier on tonight. Yeah, the reason Daniel Bryan has made it to this matchup. Meanwhile, is Daniel Bryan all of Batista with a fly buster? Oh. Triple H now summoning a new official. What the? Oh, come on. Oh, I'm sure this referee's going to be fair. It's all about what's best for business, gentlemen. It's all about screwing oh, over Batista. Daniel Bryan. We're going to put Bryan on the line of Batista Bomb. of this official. It's just continued oppression by the authority. 
trying to control the narrative. Just control remember, the match. Who signs your paycheck, Saxton? Yeah, but the bottom line is this. Daniel Bryan has had his back against the wall since the beginning of this night. He's been banged up. He's bruised. He's battered. Now he's got the authority against him once again. Trying his best to, to fight this uphill battle. Bryant's fired up. Look out! Bryant! Suicide dive down by the authority! Right now, it's Daniel Bryant against the world. Do whatever you gotta do to survive. Batista dominated at the Royal Rumble, but he's falling short of the finish line here, gentlemen. Batista needs to unleash the beast and fat. Rolling up Batista! Shoulders are down! And oh. just breaking things up is Randy Orton! How close was Daniel Bryan? As close as Daniel Bryan's ever gonna get, because now the plan is coming together, and Bryan's gonna end up on the short end of the stick. And now the assault outside the ring by Randy Orton. Remember, triple threat rules, no count out. Qualifications. Anything goes as Bryant is whipped into the barricade. And Randy Orton now unleashing fury on Bryant. Randy Orton seemingly oh, in desperation mode, along with Batista doing whatever they can to suppress Daniel Bryant. This is clearly about injuring Bryant. His career, and now Randy Orton with steel oh, no. stairs at hand. Yeah, this very well could end Brian. Oh my God, Brian driven down again. Daniel Bryan's fairy tale evening just came to a screeching halt. Look at this, Batista and Randy Orton game planning their next form of attack. This is absolutely disgusting. Oh boy. Uh, now right here in front of us, the announce table being ripped apart. And you can only imagine what Batista and Orton have planned here. Perhaps the final act to disable the dreams of Daniel Bryan. Bryan can't even move. He's defenseless out here. Bryan is giving it his all. So much heart, so much determination. Oh my God, to the announce table now. Bryan went through hell in the first match tonight and now a second match against Orton and Batista. You don't think? What the? Oh, I do think. Batista wants to end Bryan's career right here. Oh no. Oh, Up no. goes Bryan. for what you ask for, Daniel Bryan, because you just might get it. Absolute no concern for the health and well-being of Daniel Bryan. And now the uh, medical personnel bringing in a, a stretcher. What a horrible sight. No, oh, what a horrible way for this, this night to end for Daniel Bryan who fought so valiantly earlier on to beat Triple H to get to this triple threat match for an opportunity at the championship, the main event at WrestleMania. And now... Batista it, just flattened Orton. Yeah, Batista and Orton, who had an alliance moments ago, now turn this into a one-on-one -on -one match for the WWE title. That's what they wanted. That's what Batista and Randy Orton wanted. They wanted Daniel Bryan out of the equation so they could compete for the championship. Well, it's also what the authority wanted as well. Triple H and Stephanie. They wanted Daniel Bryan out of here. Been a thorn in their side forever. Batista once again in complete control. The apex predator is being beaten down. Meanwhile, uh, medical personnel continue to work on Daniel Bryan as this match continues for the WWE Championship. All right, now it's Batista who's in oh, again over the Viper. Well, the animal returned to WWE for one reason, to be the best. 
And look at Orton fighting back, but again, driven back down to the floor. Yeah, the animal could be just moments away, Corey, from accomplishing that goal. And Orton rolled back into the ring by the animal, Batista. But Orton caught him. And now Randy Orton's got Batista where he wants him. Batista took too much time. And he may pay for it. Went for the DDT, and Batista launches Orton over the top rope. Meanwhile, uh, Daniel Bryan's being stretchered back to the locker room area oh, no. for medical oh, treatment. No. Randy Orton oh. the apron face first goes Batista. And there's Bryan being carted away. Better bring that stretcher back here. We might need it for Batista. Terrible, terrible way for this night to end for Daniel Bryan. Bryan is I, I, I get the fighting spirit of Daniel Bryan, but uh, Bryan's hurt. What is Daniel Bryan doing? Bryan's got more guts than brains, period. Medical personnel try to get Daniel Bryan out of here, and now, now Orton has Bryan. Well, Randy Orton's going to make sure that Daniel Bryan heads back to the locker room on a stretcher after driving him into the steps. Orton seemingly out of this. I hope the Yes Movement's happy with this unjust turn of events. But Brian and Batista are hungry to once again be atop the WWE food chain, and it's looking likely right now. Ooh! Vicious strike. And here comes Orton. from the floor. His shoulders are down. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. This one's for good measure. He's got the shoulders down. Randy Orton feeling good about himself right now. No, there's the reversal. Back suplex. Very nice. He's going for it all. One more look at it. Here's the cover for the win. Broken up, and the match continues. Slam with authority. Got the shoulders down. One, two. He's got to be running on empty at this point. You'll need to do more. Keep Batista down for three. You gotta believe this one's over. Oh, he goes down hard. Yeah, he's definitely starting to fade now. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Momentum clearly in his corner. Jarring headbutt. Just when you thought he had nothing left. That might be the end of Batista tonight. Down to the floor. Oh, the yes lock is cinched in. Is he gonna? Oh, what a cross face. This is his opportunity to win this thing. That might be the end of Batista tonight. He did it! He did it! The Miracle Kid! The Miracle Kid! It's a miracle on Bourbon Street! Yes! He yes! 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 Daniel 
Bryan just overcame the authority. Daniel Bryan just had the greatest performance in 30 years of WrestleMania. In one night, he defeated Triple H, Batista, and Randy Orton, and is now WWE World Heavyweight Champion. I can honestly say that a win is a little more satisfying when you make your opponent tap out. We may be in New Orleans tonight, but I assure you there was nothing easy about that win right there.